welcome back to Garth Lutz Travel. So this is the same day, but I, I, this is a bonus because I didn't want to put this in the same video because it's going to take up too much space. So I just bumped into this on my way out from Tulgarn's Palace. Um, you see these beautiful horses. And as I mentioned to you guys, this place is massive. So if I was to make a whole video about the space that they have in this place, I mean, it would be endless. So as you can see, there's a road down there that goes into the forest over there which you can also take all of this land all of this belongs to the palace over there because again this is still in use and this still is owned by the royal family um i'm not sure what this is but it looks like something from you know way back in the past but anyway what i wanted to show you guys was this beautiful old school barn house um i think this is probably the second one that i've ever seen like that but i wanted to bring you guys this i'm gonna get up get there get a little bit close always funny when i'm shooting videos and like cars go by like this car just went by you know with swedish people inside and they're like looking at me like why is he recording just a barn you know you could see that curious look on their faces but for you like i said for you guys this is normal for me like seeing a, a old barn house like this yes we have them in the United States but the architecture is completely different so these are the things that excite Here, me. I guess this is where the cars drive up um, I'm not I, I'm not sure how old this is I mean the doors on it look pretty old uh, just go around here and take a look I mean there is so much of this place guys it's unbelievable um, let's see here it would be nice to see inside I mean look up there guys Look at the way they like ended, like made the wood even above the window or the air vent. Oh my gosh, look at the old, old, those doors up there. Those are really old. They, the wood is so old it even goes in. Um, yeah, so that's one side of it. I'm going to see. Well, that's all hay, as you guys already know. Again, there's a view of the property. I'm going to go around front. Here's a little sign. Um, not sure what this is uh, saying. Well, it shows which direction, but uh, here begins an interest, interesting and varied stretch of trail. The section, okay guys, so you can pause this. That's in English, above it is Swedish. It explains that there's a, this is a trail that goes somewhere. Um, and here is also in English, I guess it's another trail. And this is the map of the trails. So over here, there's a horse, oh, that's a white horse. Those are rare, <laughs> at least for me to see. Um, and then, you know, you see that there's people, again, these homes are probably leased because um, it is a part of the the land still. This whole thing is uh, Tulgarn's um, garden, uh, Tulgarn's palace. There's another brown horse over there, but I want to see this white one over there. Hey, horsey. Wow, how beautiful is that, guys? Wow, that's a really nice horse. So this is the front of the barn and again this is literally like one of the oldest barns i've seen i'm sure no i'm lying i've seen it older that was than just that a quick clip i just wanted to show you this on the way out because it was here there. is a sign um right next to the barn that explains a bit so Tulgarn's king's guard so kong's guard I'm, I'm just it's king's guard from my interpretation of swedish so it gives you all the explanation here on the board 1772 the state bought Tulgard Tulgarn as a pavilion for the royal princes uh the first prince is frederick adolf the estate was divided into a palace and a royal decimate okay guys so you can pause that. Click the like button, click the subscribe button, click the share button, guys. Comment below. Tell me what you like, what you don't like. All right? Peace, love, joy, and happiness.